Ronald Reagan signed his presidential documents. That's where I'm sitting. Okay. And that's a look at the Ronald Reagan suite do you, do you from have Century a, City. Do you have a ballroom there? Uh, there's a ballroom that's 25,000 square feet at, in the first floor of the hotel. And do they have a puppet in there? Yeah. yeah. No, there's no puppet. Thank you, Bob. There's no puppet. Suzanne Wong in L.A. Thanks, Suzanne. Laurie? Sure. Thank you very much. Still lots more to come. We're going to go back to Lebanon, Kansas, where we're all getting ready for the big parade. And we have a very special guest to introduce you as well. So please stay with us. From the right way to give a bath to the right diaper. You start with the most expensive, but then you get real and get loves. Why loves? They work great on leaks. They pass these torture tests as well as pricey brands, but loves cost less every day without coupons. With loves, there's no question, but there are other questions. Why? 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 Ask your father. Hey, live and learn, and then get loves. Is this how you start your day? It's okay. Need a little pick-me-up? Aw. Oh. Look, perfect nutrition is for perfect people. Then we don't know any. That's why there's Boost, the delicious shake that's got 25 vitamins and minerals with carbohydrates and protein instead of caffeine for real energy that lasts. So if your day isn't 100% nutritious, maybe it's time for a Boost. Boost, the perfect snack for imperfect people. TV's best drama returns for another unforgettable season. I don't know what you want from me. I'm in love with you. Party of Five, season premiere, Wednesday, August 21st. Hi, I'm Jim Palmer for The Money Store. Does it seem like the weekend is the only time to take care of personal business? The problem is, is that when you're off, just about everyone else is too. But not at The Money Store. If you're thinking about refinancing your home, you can call The Money Store this weekend and apply by phone. There's no application fee, and the chances are you'll have an approval by Tuesday. So if you want to refinance your home, call the money store this weekend at 1-800-LOAN-YES. That's 1-800-LOAN-YES. Okay, this is serious. If you're caught driving with a suspended license, a new California law allows the police to impound your car and even auction it away. There are no more second chances. Call Survival. We'll get you an immediate SR-22 filing and help you get your license back now call survival any car any driver survival offers the lowest rates guaranteed call survival now i was the designated driver but three hours later i'm in the hospital injured by a drunk driver after several weeks i was able to go home only to another problem the insurance company wanted me to settle for peanuts i called a lawyer and i'm glad i did now my doctor's taking care of my health, and my lawyer's taking care of my rights. If you've been injured, call Jacoby and Myers at 1-800-75-LEGAL. That's 1-800-75-LEGAL. It's not easy being a Lucky Produce Pro. After all, Lucky has over 300 varieties of fresh produce, like Gala apples and Fuji apples, green beans and green onions, sweet potatoes, red potatoes, yellow peppers, white corn. Well, you get the picture. You have to know all about bananas and how weather affects tomatoes. You have to know the pressure test, the sugar test, and the taste test. And you need a good signature. Because you're so proud of the produce at Lucky, you put your name on it. Lucky Produce Pros. When it comes to finding great produce at low prices, they're the toughest customers around. It's do-it-yourself fun on Home Improvement, tonight at 7 on Fox 11. Welcome back to Fox After Breakfast, live from 212 Fifth Avenue with Tom Laurie and Bob the Puppet. I'm your announcer, Nancy Giles. Thank you, Nancy, and thanks for sticking with us today. We're glad that you're back, and you're just in time for... The, the Mailbag! <laughs> of the show where we like to read viewer mail, faxes, emails. Unfortunately, of course, it's our first day, so we don't really have a lot of mail. So we have some well wishes from people that we'd like to uh, go through. The first one is a telegram from my mom. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Fox after breakfast. Tom, Laura, of course, Lori's first. Lori, Tom, oh, and Bob. That's right. That's mom building. That's yeah. good, mom. <laughs> <laughs> she goes, knock them dead and break a leg. Knock them dead and break, and a, break leg. a leg. Love, Barbara, and then in parentheses, mom. Oh. I can only do one of those things. Michael, but... did you find the other one? Because that was a... The one that you had shown me earlier about the oh, family yeah. that was really trying hard for a special event. 
Okay, here we go. Uh, this is from uh, Jim Duke. He emailed us. Mm -hmm. Okay, Fox execs, we fans of After Breakfast are cyber sensitive. We would really appreciate a web page for this show so that we could download goodies like we could on the FX page. And we do have a web page, right? And that address is yeah. forthcoming. My wife and I are longtime fans of Tom, Laurie, and Bob. I tried to get my wife to give birth to our son on August 12th. <laughs> well. Now, how would you go about doing that? Well. <laughs> hold back, honey, hold back. That's, that's, yeah, that's right. Don't breathe. Keep your legs crossed. Okay. Uh -huh. But the, the closest she could come was on July 30th. Ah, well, rest assured that uh, Jim and Catherine Duke, together with new fan Taylor Barrett Duke, will be watching the premiere. Good luck. Thanks for coming back. You were missed. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank hey. you very much. And for we're sending you baby wishes. clothes. Yeah. Thank you, too. Oh. Oh. For, uh, for any letter or fax or email that we read on the air, uh, you will send us, we will send you a uh, Fox yep. After Breakfast t-shirt. Yep. We love to get all your letters, any questions you have. And also, if you want to be one of the visiting family members, please write us. Nancy's going to tell you how to do it. That's right. We'd love to hear from you. So write us at Fox After Breakfast, Box 888, Madison Square Station, New York, New York. Zip codes 10159-0888. You can email us at foxab at foxab.com or fax us at 212-802-4207. Back to you. I'm just welcoming uh, His Honor, the Mayor of New York, Rudolph Giuliani. Yay. Yay. Thank you for being here today. Good luck. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Yes. Good luck. Now, is this a typical day for the mayor? Comes and helps launch a network show and sure, then drops absolutely. signing bills and one, stuff? One a day, right? Really? Oh, is that right? Well, yeah, <laughs> I wish. Yeah. I wish. It would be great to, good to have you for this, this one. Is can, terrific can we this talk about first for all of you since this is our, our first show? What was your first? Are you going to ask him when his first day of mayorship was yeah, on? Yeah. Oh, oh, good oh, show, yeah. but that was going to yeah. happen. Your first show. My first, be it the uh, X-Files or anything else? It was a pilot. Um, uh, what would be the first? I, I guess I'd have to talk about the first. Uh, that's all I've ever done. Just joking. Um, <laughs> the pilot of, of the X-Files was terrifying. Mm -hmm. It was um, shooting that show. It was, uh, it was my first big break, and um, it was a big deal for the producers who were involved. And... Um, and we were shooting up in, in Vancouver for the first time, mm -hmm. and new crew, and new everybody, and trying to figure everything out. And it was absolutely, it was terrifying. You guys seem a lot more relaxed and suave about it all than, than I ever could have imagined. Yeah, we have a lot less time. to lose. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Cindy? Uh, what, what was the question? I don't remember. Yeah. <laughs> the question is, first show yeah. ever yeah. did? Yeah, well, a big, big moment. Oh, big first. moment. Well, I think it was the first job I ever got, which mm -hmm. I w uh, was, this is really dating me. I don't think anyone here will remember it, but it was room 222. Uh, yes, sure. I'm sure I do. Yes. And I played a character, uh, it was my first professional job ever, and I had one, three lines, and the most difficult line was, uh, you mean a, you tell us what the topic is and we write a composition on it. And to this day, I can't say that line. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that was, uh, and I played a character called Rhoda Zagor, and it was written by Jim Brooks, and I think, le I always have thought, and I've been meaning to ask him this, if later on he mm. had uh, come up with the character's name for Rhoda. Right, You know, right. from that character. And Mayor Giuliani? Uh -huh. Your first, first day. First day on the job? My first day, on, well, actually, uh, when I gave my inaugural address, which was my second day on the job, mm. right after I was sworn in, uh, I felt this like very cold sensation dripping down my legs. Oh, lovely! And I got very, very nervous. <laughs> yeah. you know, yeah. I would say. I, I we thought feel I had given many, I had given many speeches yeah. before. This was a pretty important speech. There were thousands of people watching, millions of people watching. Then I realized why. My son Andrew, who was then uh, eight years old, was right next to me, and he had knocked over the water pitcher. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, can, can I just mention... He then, he then stood there and, and gave the inaugural address with me. <laughs> and did a much better job. We all remember that, that <laughs> visual, too. Just for future reference to the floor directors, when the mayor of a big city talks about water dripping down his leg, you've got to let him finish. I know we're running late, <laughs> but you got to... When we come back, uh, Phil Kogan and our friends in Lebanon, Kansas, the center of the continental United States, have a parade to put on the whole town. It's turned out. Stay there. <laughs> I'm a mother. I'm a 12-year-old. I'm a lover, a cook.
and a wannabe computer nerd. I'm not as young as I used to be. I am as young as I'd like to be. V8 isn't just juice. It's a full serving of the vegetables you need to keep you running on all eight cylinders. How many cylinders are you running on? Emma was a matchmaker with the best of intentions and the most outrageous results. Good God. I see you've been hard at work. Now, romance is about to find her. I love John. Emma. I hate John. Mm -hmm. Rolling Stone calls Jane Austen's timeless comedy richly entertaining and devilishly funny. It's the finest and funniest film of 96. Something has happened to the wheel and I cannot move. Emma. Well, you'll just have to live here then. Bye-bye. Rated PG. Now playing select cities. This is no ordinary toothbrush. This is a Braun Oral-B plaque remover. The new Braun Oral-B Ultra. Its ultra-speed oscillating brushing action removes plaque better than an ordinary toothbrush. That's not our opinion. That's clinical fact. And its unique cup-shaped brush head cleans even below the gum line. Dentists recommend changing your toothbrush every three months. We suggest you change it forever with the Braun Oral-B Ultra. I could do things to avoid accidents during the day. But then overnight, well, that was another story. I used regular thick pads and still had accidents. Well, Ultrathin always taught me better. Protection isn't about thick. Compared to leading thick maxis, always Ultra locks away three times the normal amount of moisture because Ultra's super absorbent core traps moisture better to help give you better protection. Ultra's this thin, but it protects better. Always Ultra Thin with wings. Cleaner, drier, protects even better. Scott Bakula, Richard Thomas, Elizabeth Pena, and Homicide's Richard Belzer in a four-hour motion picture event. The Invaders miniseries begins tonight. Welcome back to Fox After Breakfast, coming to you live from 212 Fifth Avenue with Tom, Laurie, and Bob the Puppet. I'm your announcer, Nancy Giles. Thank you very much, Nancy. Great music bringing us back in from break. And we've invited Gillian Anderson and Cindy Williams and Mayor Giuliani to watch a big parade that's about to happen in Lebanon, Texas. Kansas. I keep saying Texas, but it's Kansas. That's right, it is. It's right, it's it is. It's the center of the United States. If you balance yep. the state, the whole country on your thumb by Jiminy, it's right there. there. You've seen many a parade, right, Mr. Mayor? Oh, many. Okay. Hundreds yeah. and hundreds. Yeah. Oh. What's say? They've got, yes, they have. The people yeah. of Lebanon, Kansas, as you can see, they've all turned out for this. And Phil, I, I'm, how many are actually in the parade if most of them are lining the streets? Tom, they are lining the streets. Things are heating up. Since we crossed streets, things have really been heating up. A couple of people are watching us, are watching us right here. Gladys, who makes quilts for all the children in this community. Total population here, Tom, 349. Bonnie is expecting today, so that could change at any moment. Another person watching the parade here, uh, Maxine, who's the championship whistler. Thank you very much, Maxine. We're going to get it. We're going to get the you mayor's are you Wow. Francis Ryan to start this parade. Francis, if you wouldn't mind starting it off. That's the mayor. Mayor. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Tom, I, I am with uh, Phyllis, who is from the local paper, and a few highlights to look out for here this morning. Okay. The Jolly Mixer Square Dancers. Uh, we have the Lebanon Hub Club with a replica of the U.S. Center. And also Mona Fletcher and her garden vegetables. Look out for that. That's uh, number 17 back. That's great. Oh, this is great. The American Legion Post that just went by. The Maverick Band is coming up. And this band, uh, Phyllis, is made up of uh, the local community. Well, it's from the area. And that's why it's called the Maverick Band, because they're from all over. Now, they're moving through here, Tom. Uh, a lot of people. Unfortunately, I can't hear anything you're saying, Tom, but I hope you can just enjoy the visuals. Yes, we're yeah, enjoying the parade. Hey. And coming up a wide load, I see. <laughs> now, who, who are these people? Watch it. This is the Smith County officials. Okay, they're looking very official, as you can Kathy see. Kathy Hansen. So, Tom, uh, let's have a look here. This is the Lebanon city officials who are driving in a nice Ford. Cool. Very well uh, wow, in yeah. good condition. It's a Galaxy 500. Oh, very cool. And this, look, and this like noisy person, over. Phyllis, who's this? This comes as Smith County Sheriff and deputies. Right, he keeps control around the place. Oh, yeah. right. Now, Tom, yesterday we were lucky enough to go for a ride in the Lebanon fire truck, which is coming down here. Let's see if we can get a little siren action going here. Crank it up, would you, sir? Oh, I'll just have to tell that him. That means go you faster, put the siren Phil. On? Thank you, sir. <laughs> yeah. There you go, Tom. We've That's heard that sound. Yeah. 
That, that's also a sound that you hear if there's a, a tornado coming in this area. What's this oh, one yeah. right here, Phyllis? This is the Smith County State Bank and Trust like Serving that. Smith Center in Lebanon. And they're throwing out sweets here on the street. Looks like the crowd's right, attacking the parade route. Oh, there we go. Oh, 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 Yes, this is the uh, Lebanon ball team, the Mighty Mites, the Wee Peas, and the Pee Wee. Hey. All right. Phil, we have to keep the parade going, please, but we have to go out, I believe. And we'll check no. back with you in uh, about two and a half minutes, I would say, right no after problem. the break, though, the big wave and more from Lebanon, Kansas. Stay with us. Fox After Breakfast is brought to you by Kellogg's with good taste, nutrition, and value. The best to you each morning from Kellogg's. Good morning, good morning. It's nice to know that Kellogg's has lowered the price of many of your favorite cereals. The best to you each morning. But it's even nicer to know. K E double L O double good. There's still some things you can't put a price on. Kellogg's best to you. Do you know you put your hair at risk every time you wash it? Just combing can break it. Pantene has pro vitamins that help keep hair strong so it breaks less. Pantene Pro V. For hair so healthy, it shines. Strong can be beautiful. For my feminine itching, I depend on Vagisil Cream to stop it instantly. And for a painful burning itch, I get maximum strength Vagisil for even stronger relief. There's Vagisil cream and maximum strength. This season, you're going to the World Series and the Super Bowl. You're invited to the wildest parties, the biggest events, and the most anticipated premieres ever. This is prophecy! This is the way it ends! Only one network has a season this spectacular. Fox's Super Season. Coming sooner than you think. Managing today's complex business technology takes the right people. Christine Gladys answers the call. She's a systems representative for Amdahl Corporation and a DeVry graduate. DeVry instructors gave me more than an understanding of computers. They helped me feel at ease with technology. DeVry instructors help you understand the future of business and technology, so you get a bachelor's degree that fits tomorrow's opportunities. The future is looking good. For a higher degree of success, call DeVry, 1-800-247-7800. Hey, is your face zit city? You could use this, a natural cover-up. Or you could stick with creams and pads that don't cut it. Or you can get this, General Nutrition's Teen Skin Care System. It helps zap zits, guaranteed. You get an alpha hydroxy exfoliating cleanser, an anti-acne toner, an antioxidant day lotion, plus nourish skin tablets with vital antioxidant vitamins. Hey, you want clear skin? Don't cover it up. Clear it up with GNC's Teen Skin Care System. Only at GNC. If it wasn't your fault, why should you get stuck with the bills? I'm Larry H. Parker, and I fight for you. Call me at 1-800-333-0000. Right after my car accident, I called Larry Parker. He took care of my whole family. I called Larry H. Parker. He helped get my motorcycle fixed. Don't let him get away with it. Fight back. I'm Larry H. Parker. Call me at 1-800-333-0000. Fighting for you is my job. Welcome back to Fox After Breakfast, live from New York City.